today we're gonna go back to our local pond that we used to fish at a ton. And before the quarantine, this place wasn't terribly pressured, but since so, it's been crazy pressured. But today it's raining and it's like the middle of the day. So I don't think too many people are gonna be out here. And we're gonna go out here and we're gonna try to get them on the whopper plopper. Um, maybe try some wacky rig stuff and then definitely try some Texas rig stuff. Um, this is gonna be a quick and dirty edit video. Uh, I just wanna get something out there for you guys and uh, we'll see you out there. All right, I thought for sure this water was gonna be murky as hell. But it's not. First whopper plopper action of the season. Had some really good luck here in the rain with the whopper plopper. I don't know if it's too early in the year, but I've been seeing a lot on fish brain. People catching them on the whopper plopper, so. We'll give it a shot. I honestly thought there'd be nobody up here, but apparently I'm not the only one with nothing to do. We've got a 110 on here right now, maybe a 130. But I've got a 75 I can throw on too if, uh, if I think this is too big, but we'll throw this around for a little bit first. doing a lot of kayak centric content lately so thought it'd be good to get back to some pond fishing I mean we can call this one of the lunch break fishings uh, even though it's not really it's pretty close to it I'm on a time constraint and it's during the week so it's close enough we can call it some lunch break fishing right Sweet if we got some blow ups. Top water fishing is my absolute favorite fishing to do. I mean, I know, right? The sky's blue, but it's everybody's favorite fishing. But it's, I know, it's what got me hooked. I'm allowed to have puns like that, I'm a dad. I'm gonna be pretty quick and dirty with my spot selections too right now until we figure out what's working. Like I said, I have a wacky rig and a, uh, a prawn set up too, so we can try both of those. But I haven't been up here in a while, so I have no idea they're on beds, what's been working, other than what's on fish brain. Speaking of fish brain, I'm now on fish brain. You can just look me up at Joshua Plopper. I'll throw a link in the description so you guys can add me on fish brain. My pike video went live today, a few hours ago as of filming this. I think it's a fun little video. It's not very long, but it's my first pike on the kayak, so it was interesting getting them off. So hopefully y'all are watching that. I'd really appreciate it. I don't know if I've asked you to subscribe yet, but if you want to subscribe, I would really appreciate that too. You can click the link right there. I've decided I'll be doing some giveaways for my subscription counts. So at 500, we'll be doing either like a gift card or um, like a tackle giveaway. Nothing crazy, 25, 50 bucks. And then once we hit a thousand, which may be a year from now for all I know, but once we hit a thousand, I'm gonna do a large giveaway, a big ticket item of some sort. So, more. Catch one of those carp? Yeah. <laughs> Bass look like they're on beds. 
I see a few over here. Oh, they're not small in here, man. You want some help? <laughs> Really? Yeah, we'll come over as far as I'm allowed and check it out. I'm throwing a jerk bait. I guess he he hit it like right when uh right when it hit the water. Wow. Yeah, man. They're they're big in here. I don't I don't get it. Damn it. Oh. That was a decent one, too. Spit it. Oh, there's a small little bass. All right, well, I'll throw the net rig one more time. That was a bass size that would actually, should actually bite this. Not like that big one I lost. Here it comes. Biting it, he's got it. Uh, he let go of it. All right, we'll try again. Oh, there's that big boy again. All right, there's one. It was a far larger one that was going after it when this little guy took it. But I am going to go back in after that bigger one because he was significantly larger. And if I just toss this right out there, hopefully catching that one didn't scare him off. All right, so that didn't really go as planned. I thought they'd be a little bit more active after that storm, right? But they just weren't. Uh, we saw a lot of fish on beds. I saw a lot of fish on beds, so that's good news for the future. And then we, we caught that one and we got that other one on that was a pretty good fish, but it was my fault. I didn't really set the hook good enough on that Ned rig. So this is what it is. Tomorrow I'm heading out in the kayak out to Lake St. Clair, try to get some smally, um, smally action on this channel and yeah we'll, we'll keep getting on them i am gonna upload this video as a little bit of a bonus video um yeah, so hopefully you guys enjoy it peace hey,